Hello, my name is Robin Huris, and I have an extremely rare genetic disease of the telomere biology known as dyskeratosis congenita. Dyskeratosis congenita, or DC, occurs in less than 1 in 1 million people worldwide and affects systems in the body with rapid rates of cell reproduction, such as the skin and bone marrow. At this time, nine years ago, I was tucked into a room at Fairview University Medical Center in Minneapolis, Minnesota. I had been outfitted with a central line and in the previous several days had received five doses of chemotherapy and one dose of total body irradiation to make room in my dysfunctional bone marrow for healthy stem cells. Donated by my brother and infused through that central line, those cells quickly found room in my marrow and took root. Doctors were amazed at how quickly those stem cells grew. Less than three weeks after my infusion, I was released from the hospital. In a matter of months, I went from a transfusion dependent anemic to a woman whose blood counts were and remain off the charts. DC patients had underwent stem cell transplant at Fairview University before me. However, I was the very first patient to receive a less intense preparatory regimen. Because of the specialized care, my organs were spared the toxicity associated with a traditional transplant, and I survived. That sadly was not the case for those that had gone before me. Across the world and nation, doctors are slowly getting the message that DC patients must receive the same type of transplant as I, or they will die. But anecdotal evidence and word of mouth is not enough to get the message across. Doctors need this information spelled out in the language they understand which is why Dyskeratosis Congenita Outreach, a family support foundation aimed at supporting those affected by DC, is in the process of printing the first ever clinical treatment guidelines. This book will not only highlight the appropriate way to transplant a DC patient, but detail the many manifestations and treatments for this disease. While DC Outreach is well on its way to printing this book, we still need financial support to make it a reality. Your donation today will ensure that DC patients in need of a transplant receive the same type as I and have the gift of life for years to come. Thank you for your support.